Hey guys, welcome back to Auto Repair guys. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. In today's video guys, we'll be working on a BMW guys 3 series. So if you have guys BMW F30 guys, F31 or the GT3 series guys, and you need to remove that molding piece right here around the doors guys. Okay, this is the piece I'm talking right here. Okay, that whole piece that goes towards the back stair with us, we'll show you guys how to do that. Uh, quick introduction to the channel, guys. Every single car we get at the shop, we make at least, guys, 200 videos. On BMW 3 Series specifically, guys, we'll have probably close to three to 400 videos. Why? Simply because our mission in the shop is to save you guys as much money as we can. All we need in return, please subscribe to the channel and like the video, guys. All the tools and parts that we use in our videos, or if you need to buy any uh, parts for your car, check out, guys, the link in the description of the video below, and you can see where we get all that from. Now, this is, guys, 2013 328i that we'll be working on and we will show you guys okay how to remove okay that piece right here is very important how you do it otherwise you can severely damage it guys okay this piece right here and uh, I'll show you guys what you do so you don't break it like I do and if that happens we'll explain guys how to fix the clips as well right here you have one clip guys this is the hardest one to do ours broke you go with a plastic panel too okay and you need to push that way okay that way and when you push that way okay clip is right here let me get it out that's what it looks like this clip is supposed to be okay this clip is supposed to be guys uh, glued to the rail but in our case guys it came loose so we have to re-glue it we're going to use epoxy to re-glue it and install it later now you come on top guys okay make sure you stand till the end i'm going to show you where each of the clip is located if you look through the top you can find where the clips are guys and once you see the clip okay you need to push down from that point on okay one clip here came loose now we're coming down there another clip then we keep doing that guys until we come to another clip okay and I have a little bit of hard time okay trying to see where this one is okay you can see it came loose now these clips we can remove them and reinstall them later I'll show you how to do that let's just keep doing that towards the front guys okay this one will come loose as well from what I can see but we're going to reinstall them so that's okay that's no problem guys because otherwise it's almost impossible to get it out and if you need to buy replacement clips we'll try to share guys guys uh, we'll try to share the link in the description of the video below so please check it out okay some of them come off some don't so we have to be careful guys okay just drop a leaf inside trying not to get the car dirty All right, now let's start removing the clips. The trim is out, guys. That trim is out. Now, let me show you how we're going to remove each of the clips. Okay, we're going to send the concentrate on this one here. You go with the uh, trim remover to underneath. Okay, let me get the farther one. This one is too thin and I won't be able to pull them out. And then you just grab the clip. Okay, this is the clip right here. We get, get the rail okay this is the rail this is the clip that i missed guys okay and what we're going to do we're going to install it in the canal okay this one is supposed to go more okay perfect and then you can position it where it was supposed to be and you keep doing that guys for the rest of it but you can see that's how you guys remove the trim piece now we have to remove all our clips and the last one we just need to re-glue because ours got loose so hopefully guys the video will be helpful thank you for watching please subscribe to the channel for more videos and see you guys next time